it's been kind of hot in that garage, <laughs> but at least today it was a little cooler. Yeah, well, we're going to have some cool weather. We've had cooler weather today, Marcella, and I I'm telling you, it seems like everybody noticed because everyone's coming up to me. Can you keep this going through the weekend? I think we can. Look at these highs around the county today. Now, downtown at 77, that's a little above our average, but no one's complaining after the mid 80s that we saw all last week and the inland microclimates low 80s to upper 70s who can complain about an 81 in valley center 80 in escondido for you folks in the mountains you were in the low 70s as well and even borrego look at borrego at 96 degrees yeah i know 96 is hot but it's nowhere near as hot as it was last week or the week before or the week before time lapse check this out here's why we're cooling down the onshore flow has returned why look at that creep in isn't that cool and all the lights bubbling up underneath the marine layer, relatively thin, but starting to get thicker and thicker. So by the time we get to say Sunday, Monday into Tuesday morning, maybe some sprinkles here or there. That's a live shot from our Mount Soledad cam. We're currently at 71 degrees. Winds are calm, humidity at 66%. So a pretty nice evening out there if I do say so myself. So the onshore flow builds in over the weekend and we'll see a chance of, as I said, some drizzles, Sunday, maybe Monday and Tuesday, more likely, and then high pressure starts the work week. So as we transition from a cooling trend, we'll transition back into a warmer weather pattern. As you look at how things are shaping up over the western United States, how about Truckee at 39 degrees? That, that's cold. I'm, I'm calling 39 degrees cold. Out in Las Vegas, they're at 78, 44 at Flagstaff with elevation. The same with Cedar City at 61 degrees. Phoenix not bad at 84 and our very own Palm Springs at 80 Los Angeles at 65 at the Civic Center. Here's the western satellite loop and the marine layer continues to redevelop along the coastline. We saw that in the time lapse and this little cutoff low that is spinning just off of say Point Conception. This combined with this flow to the Pacific Northwest is going to enhance our marine layer. And so by the time we get into Sunday and Monday, this surface flow will move on through. And as it does, it will cool things down even more and bring us a chance, as I said, of some light drizzle that shows up in our forecast. Saturday, not so bad, cool, dry in the morning, but Sunday and Monday is where we get a chance at that drizzle coastal. Then we get a quick warm up 95 in those inland microclimates, and then we stay pretty warm right on through the rest of the work week and into the weekend. For you folks in the mountains, overnight lows in the 40s, deserts, you're going to get back into the low 100s, but it looks like at least the weekend shaping up to be pretty nice here in Southern California.